Hello everyone. These tutorials are based on uh, Microsoft Access, the database software. In the market, other software uh, database softwares are also available, such as Microsoft SQL Server, or SQL Server, Oracle, Foxbase, uh, and many other databases are available. So uh, to start for Microsoft Access, that how Microsoft how to build the database or tables in Microsoft Access. First, I would like to cover the basic concepts of data, information, and database. So, okay, what is raw data, data, and information? Many of you will be already aware, but those users who are not aware, just for their information, we will cover raw data. The term refers to the fact that has not been processed yet. Facts or figures, you can say, sometimes referred to as source data, such as 0, 1, ABC, etc. When it comes to the data, so data means facts, figures, attributes, uh, properties, you name it. Example, for example, John, grade 1, enrolled, 2017, these are facts like figures 2017 that's that's a fact and figure but we don't know what does it mean so let's come to the information which states that once the data is processed then it gives meaning to that data is known as information or in other terms meaningful data is called as information now let's process the above facts and figures so it will come down to information such as think about John grade 1 enrolled in 2017 it is not giving any meaning to these figures I mean it's not meaningful uh, maybe somebody can say that John has passed grade 1 and he was enrolled in 2017 so until unless these facts and figures are not processed so we will not get correct information Example, John is enrolled in grade 1 for 2017 session. So this is an example of information which is being taken by uh, after processing the data. So let's move on to the next slide. Now I'll come to what is database. Database is basically pool of information. So as as an example or definition of the database is particularly specifically is a set of collection of information that is organized so that it can ease it can be easily manipulated accessed and managed now already we have seen example of data and information so we'll take an example now you can see student ID 1001, 1002, name John, grade, grade 1, session 2017, fee 2000 and city, London. 